You know, bass season here in the North Country is just about here. Many of you down south are already out there setting hooks on big largemouth bass, already competing in tournaments. You're seeing it all over, but in the North Country, ice is coming off the lakes. We're starting to think about where we're going to go and what we're going to tie on the first time we hit the open water season. For me, it's a creature bait. It's pretty simple. I fish one of two creature baits, one being the Pocket Series Craw from Mr. Twister. And the reason I fish this bait is for several reasons. First and foremost, like all pocket series baits, they have those dimples, those depressions, those holes on the back side of the lure. And what that does is it traps in air, it kicks off vibration, gives some added noise, gives some impulse to attract some of these fish to bite, gives you an appeal that you're not used to seeing in, in most plastics on the market. The other key characteristic is the durability of this plastic. With most baits, you may lose a bait on the hook set, a hard, heavy hook set. Fish comes in hot, you miss it, you may lose your bait. I'm catching three, four, five, six, seven or more fish on one soft plastic bait. For me, that's a big deal. I can flip back in there, keep fishing, keep being productive. Another big thing is all the various options and color choices. Most competitors are going to give you maybe six, seven, at eight at best choices. You're going to have a whole array of choices with this pocket craw, everything from Okaboji craw to laminate versions to two tones like you see here in my hand. So you have an option to match just about any presentation, any situation, no matter the body water, no matter what part of the country you're fishing, you can get that option for you. The other big thing I like is it really stands up nice and really mimics a crawfish. Some crawfish baits get heavy, they like to fall flat, they look cool, cool in the package, but they don't necessarily do what you want them to do when it's in the water. This bait's going to really mimic a craw, it's going to do what you want, and it's going to give you the desired results. So for me, when I start hitting open water season, I'm going to throw on a pocket series craw, I'm going to tip it, I'm going to fish it with a Texas rig, I may tip it on a jig. The versatility of this bait's just about endless. Make sure you tie one on, give it a shot if you haven't already, and catch some fish.